ingredients required 1 cup of thur dal half cucumber so this is the size of the cucumber that i have taken we need to remove the seeds and cut into small pieces see i have removed the seeds and i have not removed the skin this is yam we need to cut into small pieces remove the skin wash it well this is pumpkin wash it well and cut into small pieces we need to remove the skin carrot i've taken one carrot brinjal i've taken only one brinjal because we are adding too many vegetables i am reducing the size of the vegetable this lady's finger drumstick i have taken four drumstick here shallots 12 shallots three green chilli one tomato and coming to the masala powders turmeric 1/4 tablespoon chilli powder 1 tablespoon coriander powder 1 and 1/2 tablespoon salt to taste mustard seeds garlic red chilli ink powder associated a powder and one lemon size tamarind i've taken we need to uh, make the tamarind juice smash it and get the juice and little curry leaves so these are the things that's required for seasoning so i've taken it separately jeera mustard seeds red chilli and curry leaves so we need to cook the thur dal so for the boiling water i'm adding the dal and cook for uh, around 20 minutes so i'm just removing the lid and checking whether it's been cooked so if you want to add water we can add water at this point you can also cook the uh, dal in the pressure cooker and when you cook you can add vegetables that i'm going to add now now the dal is cooked so i'm adding carrot cucumber and the yam because it requires uh, more time to be cooked so i'm adding these three vegetables first if you're using pressure cooker to boil the dal you can add these three vegetables and uh, wait until one whistle because we need to add the other vegetables also and then boil so i'm adding little more water and then close the lid and boil you have my heart you have my soul you have my whole you have my control so you need to check whether the yam and the carrot is been cooked properly so i'm just checking that So I'm just smashing it with the spoon. So at this point, we can add the other vegetables. So I'm adding drumstick. Brinjal. and also pumpkin so these three vegetables cooks uh, early so i'm adding it at the later stages so if you're using pressure cooker don't add these three vegetables after one whistle remove the lid and add these vegetable and cook So it's almost done now we can add the turmeric powder 
and required salt so i'm using rock salt here you can use the powdered salt stir it well and cook by closing the lid so allow it to cook and the side by side we can do the next step take a pan add coconut oil add red chilli mustard seeds jeera and curry leaves i love it to splatter fry it well you can add garlic and the shallots now sort it well until the onion color changes to light brown we can add the green chili add lady's finger add little salt to so let the lady's finger cook well and we need to add the ink powder the acetated a powder now i've added uh, a two pinch of ink powder now add tomato I love tomato to cook. Close the lid and cook. Now add turmeric powder. Add very little turmeric powder because we have already used turmeric powder to the other uh, the previous step. Add the coriander powder. One and a half tablespoon of coriander powder. Now we need to add the samba powder. Two and a half tablespoon of samba powder. Sort it well. Add chili powder and mix it well. See to it that the chili powder does not get burnt. So keep on stirring. Smash the tomatoes, and now add tamarind water. Only the water. We need to take the uh, pulp water only. So we need to add this to the first step and mix it well. cook for few minutes and switch off the flame if you if you need water to be added add the water at this point so i'm adding little water because uh, once the uh, sambar uh, curry gets cooled it becomes thick because uh, dal has been added so i'm adding more water Check the salt at this point, and if the salt is less, you can add it. Corona announcement is going on, so please bear with me. You can close the lid and cook, and switch off the flame after two minutes. My mom's samba recipe is ready. If you like, please try. Let me know your opinion. Subscribe to my channel for more videos. Click on the bell icon for notification. Thanks for watching. Bye.